Drew Brees unfortunately tore ligaments in his right thumb and is expected to miss six weeks. This is very unfortunate. I am so sorry that this happened to him. The good news is he's going to be out for six weeks and he can still come back and help the Saints make it to the Super Bowl. Yes, I said that. The Saints still have a chance to make it to the Super Bowl as long as Teddy Bridgewater can hold it down until Breeze gets back. And I believe in Teddy Bridgewater. To me, he is the perfect backup quarterback for this team. He has experience playing in the NFL. He is a great game manager and he's going to get a lot of reps this week. So he'll be primed and ready to go. He's going to hold it down until Drew Breeze gets back. And when Breeze gets back from this thumb injury, I'm telling you, the Saints are going to march on to the Super Bowl. I still have them making the Super Bowl despite Drew Brees being out for a significant amount of time. They are my pick. They're still going to win. The defense is also going to play very well too. So the offense is going to rally around this injury. The defense is also going to rally around this injury. They're just going to play well. Everybody on the Saints is going to step up their level of play. So I'm telling you, uh, yes, am I concerned? Yes, I'm not going to sit here and act like I'm not. The thing is though, I believe in Bridgewater, I believe in that defense, and I believe in Sean Payton. He always has his team ready to play. So the Saints are going to do a great job while Breeze is out. Now, they have to take care of the football. Their margin for error is very, very small. So they have to take care of the football. Teddy Bridgewater cannot be turnover prone. The defense cannot give up 30, 40 points. And I believe the defense is good enough to slow down most offenses. I don't see them allowing teams to go crazy with scoring a lot of points. They know what's at stake here. They know that the playoffs are at stake and the Super Bowl is at stake. So they're gonna just step up their game. The offense is gonna step up their game too. Teddy Bridgewater is just gonna find a way to get the ball in the playmakers' hands. So playmakers like Michael Thomas and Kamara and Tyson Hill, he's gonna find a way to get, the, get them the ball. And when these dynamic players get the ball in their hands, they always have the ability to score, and they will. They're gonna score a lot of touchdowns. Now, I'm not saying that Bridgewater is Breeze. Uh, I'm not saying that he's gonna play as well as Breeze, but he's good enough. He's good enough to win the Saints a couple of games. So I really believe that. He is a quality backup quarterback. I'm glad he's there because he's gonna help the Saints win. He's gonna hold it down until Drew Brees gets back. That's what I believe, and many Saints, many Saints fans believe that as well. So all is not lost with the Saints. Like I said, Sean Payton is there. He's gonna motivate them. He also knows what is at stake too. So he's gonna find a way to keep this going. He's gonna find a way to help the Saints score points. He's gonna motivate that defense to step up the level of play. The special teams do well too. You know, the Saints special teams is nice. So everything is all good. Yes, Drew Brees is out. And I am, am I concerned? Yes. Are many Saints fans concerned about this? Of course, yes. But it's all good. Bridgewater's gonna hold it down. The Demons will hold it down. And when Drew Brees comes back, he's gonna pick up right where he left off and the Saints are gonna march on to the Super Bowl. They will be playing in Philadelphia. So that's what's gonna happen. So hopefully, like I said, Bridgewater can hold it down until Drew Brees gets back. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. You should definitely subscribe to my channel. If you have not done so already, just press the red subscribe button below this video. If you did that, I would greatly appreciate it and plus you'll be getting more content from me. So definitely subscribe to my channel so you won't, you won't miss out on anything that I post. Thanks again for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that all of you have a blessed, wonderful day.